Why well, hello, happy Monday. I always love Mondays because I feel like they're always fresh starts so I really like Mondays. But are you ready to clean my bathroom with me? I'm gonna need your help because cleaning bathrooms like isn't that fun but it must be done and my bathroom is honestly really really messy so yeah. Oh hey Kirstie199, thank you for joining. How are you? Hope you're doing really well. Oh, hey, crop.abby. Thanks for letting me know that it's you. Hey, thank you for joining. Hope you're having a great Monday. Mondays are honestly the best and deserve everything. Um, hey, Caroline. Hope you had an amazing day. Thank you. Thank you. My day has been pretty good. I always like Mondays. Like I said, they're fresh starts, you know? What time is it for you? Um, it is about 2 o'clock, so it's the afternoon. Which I'm very, I don't know about you, but I'm very much like an afternoon person. I really like the afternoons. I feel like I get a lot done in the afternoon. It's like when I have my energy, because in the morning I'm always pretty tired, and at night I, I get really tired at night too. So, afternoon. Here we come. Oh, and guess what? So today I'm like doing all this fun stuff lately. I've been doing like, like on Friday, I did Fitness Friday. Oh, by the way, these are great to whiten your teeth. Let's put these in the side. Oh, there's, oh, those tissues look so bad. Anyways, sorry, what was I even saying? What was I talking about? Oh yeah, yeah, so I did like Fitness Friday on Friday, <laughs> well obviously, then on Saturday I did, what did I do on Saturday? I'm totally losing my train of thought. Did I do song Saturday? I forgot what I did on Saturday. I totally forgot. But, I did spa Sunday, which was super fun, and then today I'm doing Manny Monday. Which has been everything so far. Um, I like rated a bunch of manicures and like really extra manicures because I'm very much a manicure person and so I love it. Oh, these need to go over here. And so that was really fun for me. And tomorrow I'm going to do something really fun. But I don't want to reveal it yet, but I'm really excited for what I'm going to do tomorrow. But I have to film it. So, see, look at all these sleep masks. The sleep mask should not be in the bathroom. They should be in the closet. Okay, let's try to organize this. Hopefully this won't take too long. I wanna make it good. Oh, these gotta be thrown out too. And I don't know what these are. So, there's that. Oh, sorry, I didn't go down. Sorry, I missed a bunch of stuff. Ooh, what color are you gonna do? I'm going to do this. I'm it after basically so I've been talking a lot about like procrastination on my TikTok and how like the best way to get yourself to do something is to like give yourself a reward after so my reward is I'm going to clean my bathroom but then after I clean my bathroom I'm going to reward myself by painting my nails for Manny Monday pink glitter which I know I just did it like not that long ago but it it's already completely off because I'm the worst nail biter in the whole entire world and it's really bad um it's like at this point I didn't even make it my like resolution because I was like well I'm never going to quit so what's even the point of making that my resolution because I can't not quit my nails but if you have any tips for like not for stopping quitting your nails please let me know because I really need help on that front you know like really how did you write the song healthy let me paint the picture for you it was it was a saturday afternoon and it was a weekend and lots of stuff was happening i was feeling very triggered by the toxic relationship in my life so yeah i was like around the person too and stuff so a lot of stuff was happening. And so then I went in my room, closed the door after I stopped talking to that person and I just wrote and I was like, I want this song to be really honest. I really want these lyrics to be good. So I was like, 
just write how you feel like write what you feel like because usually when I write songs I'll kind of use like a bunch like basically what I'll do a lot is I'll just write a bunch of feelings and then like work off of those feelings but for this one I decided you know I'm just like honestly gonna completely and totally write from the heart and I did and so it was fun and it was a very like it was very that aesthetic so it was fun what did you get at Starbucks? I got green tea because green tea is everything. But they did give me a straw. And you can see in California, um, a lot of us don't like plastic. So a lot, now all their cups like don't have straws. But I don't mind it. Honestly, I would rather drink the drinks with no straw than drink it with um what is it then drink it with the paper straw because i really don't like the paper straws because they get they get kind of soggy and then it's kind of gross to be honest what does this top go to where does this go? i don't know what this goes to that's strange hmm um, oh, hi, Bella. How are you? Thank you so much for joining. What's your inspiration for your new song slash album? Well, basically toxic relationships. I'm really into the toxic relationship stuff because I've just lived it. I know it well, and I just think it's important. And I think it's important to, like, um, you know, talk about toxic relationships, but I also think it's good to talk about them in a way that you should leave absolutely but if you don't leave like I'm not gonna shame you because I think sometimes people can do that and if they're in a bad relationship they'll shame the person for not leaving but nobody should do that because you really don't know the situation and why they can't leave or don't feel comfortable leaving or it's just soon because it's like one day you will leave but you kind of just have to leave in your own time and I hope everybody does end up leaving but you know you have to do it in your own, own time you can't be too pushed into it but I do hope if anybody's in a toxic relationship that you leave because I do think there's so much freedom to be learned from that we're almost done with the bathroom oh my gosh that was a quicker quicker than I thought it'd be so we're not totally done yet but oh well what's your favorite thing in your bathroom my favorite thing in my bathroom probably my eyeshadow I love eyeshadow Ooh, this sock I'm obsessed with this sock because it's so fuzzy and I feel and it's really soft it reminds me of the 80s but it shouldn't be in the bathroom so I have to put it away oh this looks so much cleaner i'm so glad i did this i'll show you the after oh i forgot to show you the before but i'll definitely show you the after when it looks so much better it's kind of like um the song in legally blonde so much better i love that song that's like my favorite broadway show too that should have been put away. Why was that not put away? Oh, actually, maybe this is my favorite thing. They're Crest whitening strips, and they white your teeth, which is really nice because um, I don't know about you, but I haven't gone to the dentist in a really long time because of COVID. Because honestly, like, I take COVID pretty seriously, and I just don't feel very comfortable, like, going to a dentist because I feel like they really get in your teeth and are just like too close so I don't really feel comfortable going right now so it's really good to keep up the oral hygiene so now let's put some of this stuff away in the closet because it should have been in the bathroom should have been in the closet so yeah have you ever had acrylic nails um I have before it was so fun when I had them but it just, like, it really didn't, like, it was a fun thing to do. Like, maybe I would do it if I had a special event or, like, once a year just for a special thing. But I would never do it all the time because it's a lot. 
and I just, I can't keep them on. And also it takes so long, it's more expensive. So I really would not do it like again. But in Cassie, when I got, but the, here's the thing, like I'm not hating on acrylics at all. Like I love acrylics, I think they're so cute. But I just, like when I got them, it was so weird. I, they, they like really hurt and they kept falling off and it was so heavy. I feel like my actual nail under got super, super damaged and it just kind of hurt, so. Caroline, tomorrow I'm gonna be in a Zoom meeting with my bestie and my crush at in real school lunchtime. Oh my gosh, to chat to them. I'm so nerv nervous sighted. Oh my gosh, I love that word, to talk to him. Oh my gosh, don't be nervous, be excited. It's interesting, I actually, once um talked to somebody who told me whenever you feel nervous remember like don't say tell yourself you're nervous tell yourself you're excited because the thing is the feelings of being nervous and the feelings of being excited are like the same thing it's like your heart rate's a little bit up like you're like ooh, like you're anticipating it so remember be excited don't be nervous and there's no reason to be nervous because he's gonna love you and if he doesn't that's his loss and you aren't meant to be. So there's really no pressure. So it's just best to totally be yourself. I have to get my wisdom teeth out. You do? You have to get your wisdom teeth out? Ow. I'm so sorry. I am like, I'm honestly the luckiest human in the world because I don't have wisdom teeth because I have, um, I have like, I have a really small mouth and so I don't have that many teeth, and so I have no wisdom teeth, so I never have to get them out, which I'm so thankful for, but I'm so sorry. I hope it's not too bad, although I know, um, I've known a couple people who have gotten their wisdom teeth out, and they've actually told me that, like, it hasn't been bad, and one time, um, somebody I knew got their wisdom teeth out, and I kind of, like, helped them recover or while I was there during the recovery and it they really weren't in that much pain like it wasn't bad like it was crazy they like because I think the first day you get it you're supposed to only eat ice cream or something but they were like eating solid food the first day honestly I don't think they were supposed to <laughs> but they did and it turned out fine so yeah but now I would need a rag because I need to clean the um thing what should we use to clean it should we use windex let's use windex i feel like windex is a great thing i'm gonna do a zoom with people who like my tiktok videos oh my gosh that's so exciting i love that zooming is so fun like i feel like the best part of quarantine has honestly been zoom because it's really fun okay we're well, i'm almost ready to show you i just have why is there hair on the on my i don't even know what to call this my sink i guess but it's larger than a sink i don't even know i'm sorry i'm tired today but oh my gosh i love zooming zooming is so fun Let's make this so clean. It's gonna be sparkling. Oh, I don't know what that is. I have to go to dinner, but it was fun talking to you. You're so sweet. Oh, thank you. I always have so much fun talking to you. I think you're so sweet. I think you're such like a sweet girl. Why, what is this? And why aren't they, why isn't it coming out? Come on. Why is there hair? I like, I don't know what to do with the hair. See, it's so scary when you go around the house and you start cleaning. And this has happened to me when I've started cleaning. I start finding all this hair everywhere. And it's so weird. I'm like, where did this hair come from? Is it my hair? Am I losing all my hair? Am I gonna go bald? It's very scary. I'm like, oh my gosh, why am I losing so much hair? Has anybody else experienced that? Or is that just me? I hope it's not just me. And I can't get these out. Let me show you. It's really weird. These, like what is that? Do you see that? I can't get it out. Maybe it's just like, maybe it's not anything. I don't know. I tried. 
whatever. Oh, I just did stress balls. Oh, is that when you um like squeeze the balls when you're stressed? I think those that's like such a good idea and such a good thing to do. By the way, okay. The bathroom is clean and finished. Are you ready to see it? Are you ready to see the bathroom? In a five, six, seven, eight. Voila! Bathroom clean. Look how clean. Yes. Spot. Why? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Spotless, hopefully. Have a